everybody, this is Obi-Wan 362, and welcome back to Luigi's Mansion. In the last part, we took down Vincent Van Gogh and caught all of the booze in the mansion. And in this part, we are heading down to face the final boss. That is right. We are coming down to face King Boo himself. Oh, I'm scared. I don't... I don't know what that slowdown was there, but... Anyway, we traverse this windy corridor. Look, we got all the stuff. Cramp. The final time we will see the epic door key turn. An epic lion handle. A shaking glove. The epic handle turn. The epic door pulling open. Inside. Yes, it is the secret altar. But first we want to check this. And find the blue jewel. Yes, there's Mario kind of on the painting in the background. Yes, check these chandeliers. This is your last chance to get money. If you need money, now is the time. Check this one. Nothing. Okay. So, it's time to confront King Boo. Ah, I just stare at my Mario painting for hours. It's true what they say about fine art. It takes utterly refined sensibility to truly appreciate it. The way you plead for help, Mario, I find it so satisfying. Perhaps that is merely because I remember how much trouble you've caused me in the past. Seriously, though, who would actually believe the mansion is giving away in contests? Talk about stupid. What do they feed you, Mario Bros, anyway? Gullible soup? <laughs> Your brother came all this way just to get turned into a painting. It's just terrific. However, <laughs> that this Mario painting looks lonely. I must have a Luigi painting as well. Then my gallery will truly be complete. Blah! I'm not afraid of you, fool. I feel only that Inferno bolt to kill us 3,000 you carry on your back, stupid machine. But I am a king among booze. I swear it. I shall fear no mere house cleaning device. I must say, I despise the way you shwerp, shloop, whorp, schlog, vacuumed up all my friends. Don't imagine that I will flee. I'll fight you like a true boo. Now join your brother inside the painting. <laughs> mm. That's creepy. Creepy. Mommy, help me. And look, Mario became Bowser. King Boo flew into a painting? What? Mar no, no. Bowser. Ah, he's gonna suck us. Run, Luigi. Run, run. Oh, fail. I'm scared. I'm scared. Is anybody scared? I'm scared. What's gonna happen? What's going to become of poor Luigi? What's going to happen to us? Oh, crap. And when did Bowser get so big? He's been drinking his milk. Oh, frick. Oh. Frick. Fire! He breathes fire! We're all done. We're all done. Okay. It's okay, because I have a vacuum. The secret weapon of all house people. Okay, what you want to do is you want to suck up these balls. They don't move, but and it's. Ugh! Missed that. What you want to do is you want to. You want to sh fire it at him as he opens his mouth to do his attack. That is the timing on it. Only problem is when you start sucking on these, sucking, trying to suck these up, they don't really move. You just kind of have to hit. It. You have to actually touch it in order to grab it. Oh, and the head breathes ice. Go figure, right? Anyway, yeah, you get that much time to suck up King Boo before he goes back inside his Bowser costume. So just get back at it. Watch the fire, watch the fire! Spike balls of death! F oh! Dang it. And then he catches Luigi's hat on fire. And nobody likes that. So I don't understand. The thing blew up right next to him, and he's like, No, I'm good. 
I am unstoppable. Oh, and then he breathes fire on our epic. Mm, it's giving me a spike ball of death. He keeps throwing these at us, and they're completely ineffective. Oh, the move failed. Ah, oh, there we go. King Boo, come here. Come here. Come here. No, come here. I've got you now. I have you now. In the vacuum. In the... Ooh. Ooh. It's a thing. They give you a boo to take down with 500 HP. And I hated the 300 HP ones. Get behind the column. See? Told you get behind the column. I chose you to listen now. And I missed. Gosh dang it. Why can't I just ground pound his tail? Or grab him by the tail and swing him around. Like Mario does. Oh. It's gonna hurt. Okay. Yes, the price we paid hit Mecha Bowser. That's his name. Mecha Bowser. It's like Mecha Godzilla. Except this one's piloted by a boo. I don't think Mecha Godzilla was. Okay, this is funny. His head's on backwards, and he can't fix it. So he just runs around for a while. What you want to do is if you come back here, hide behind the chimney or this house roof thing, I don't know what to call it. Then you can hide there until he gets his head on straight. Uh, suck it up. Oh, frick! He jumped in the air. Okay, when he jumps in the air, just run. Run to the opposite side of the mansion from where he was. You do not have time to suck up those spike balls and shoot them at him before they explode. So, don't even try. Suck this up. And. It somehow went between his legs. Curse you, Nintendo logic! Only you could figure out how to make that work. I thought about saying that a different way, and then I realized that's probably not the best idea. Oh, well, just died. Come on, come on. Throw me in. Yeah, I dare you. Come on, come on. Ready? And fail. The move failed. Oh, there we go. Sure, I'm injured. That's okay. Come on. You're mine, King Boo. In the vacuum. In the vacuum. 58. No, come back. Gosh dang it. One more time. I always had them backwards. <laughs> How's it feel now? You king of Koopas. Koopa King. Koopa 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 Koopa. Koopa. Kappa Cabana! I don't know. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Anyway. Come on. Bring it. Bring it. Gosh dang it. You have to jump in the air, don't you? To be all showy like. Nobody, nobody cares for your show. Alright. All they want to do is see you die. That's right. You're a ghost, but you can still die. Bring it on, Spike Balls. Frick fire yes your soul is mine king boo wait for it wait for it come on get in the vacuum get in the vacuum yeah your soul is mine and i get his crown that's right that is right oh no oh and bowser goes down yeah mario never did that did he no no he didn't oh oh what now what now, question mark, question mark, question mark. <gasps> Luigi. Luigi, you did it. Truly remarkable, my boy. Oh, yes, we are good. I supplied the Poltergeist 3000, but you ran with it all the way to the top, Sonny. You made me so <laughs> proud. <gasps> Get a hold of yourself, God. What's that? You found King Boo? He jumped into a painting of Bowser, you say? He even blew fire at you? Well, well, in all my years of ghost research, I've never heard such a fantastic tale. And that career spans 60 years, mind you. Why, I still recall starting out as a young whelp who trembled at the mere thought of a ghost. Trembled, I say. Oh, beg your pardon, this old brain goes recollecting. Every now and then, I could sit down and fill a week spinning ghost yarns. Why, just last... <laughs> 
<laughs> right. Well, anywho, Luigi, grab your brother's painting and bring him to the lab. <laughs> the poor little fellow's fallen asleep. He must have just collapsed with relief and exhaustion when he saw you arrive. I'll get the machine ready to return your brother to his former state. Already, I'll be expecting you both. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Mario, we're here. Wow. Okay. Wow, apparently King Boo captured Mario on his first try because he got a gold frame. This'll mess with your head. All your hard work lasted only a single night. Well done, Luigi. The mansion of those boos built disappeared into the night. But that treasure seems to be real. I have no interest in such stuff. So go on and keep it all. Use it however you like. Say what? Enough rattling on about money? I guess we'd better get your brother back then. Of course, your brother's really important. But first, we have to take care of these last ghosts. Okay. And there's a Bowser head. We didn't catch a Bowser head though. That's the thing. That's what's weird about this. We caught that boo in there, but we didn't catch a Bowser head. I, I, I don't know. I don't know. You know what I'm saying. The ghosts are invisible. How many times are you gonna tell us this? So we need to <laughs> press them into visible forms. Press. Presto, turn them into beautiful ghost portraits. Bowser. Jarvis. Soupy. Vincent Van Gogh. Uncle Willie. The three soldiers. The Eskimo. Hmm. I'd wager dollars to donuts that nobody but me has such lovely paintings. Hehehe. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh. Now you've caught Area 4. Uncle Grimly. Jarvis. Vincent Van Gogh. Soupy. Clockwork Soldiers. Sir Weston and King Boo. Bronze Frame. Gosh. You've caught a total of 23 ghosts. Okay, come on, come on. We need a hundred million jewels for this to work. Million, million. Let's see if we can get it. Come on, come on. Don't worry, she'll hold together. Yeah, me, baby, hold together. Yes, come on, come on. Yes, 112 million G. That's right. Eat it. Mm -mm. Eat it. Mm -mm. Eat it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. All right. And save. Ta-da! Game was saved. Time for epic final scene. I love the music here. <laughs> That was anticlimactic. Whoa! Mamma mia. <coughs> oh, he's crying. Or laughing. Oh, Mario. But yes, that was Luigi's Mansion. I hope you all enjoyed this LP. It was a lot of fun. Oh, goodness. Such a good game. But yeah. Um. Bulasas. But yeah. I would like to thank my awesome artist 
Mr. Kevin Danes for his awesome work on those drawings you saw at the end of each boss fight segment. Um, yeah. I have some projects in the works right now. Some LPs soon to come. Hopefully you all will be looking forward to that. I know I am. And... Yeah. <laughs> Luigi in the head. I love that part. Such a great picture. So yeah. Um. The only... Things we were really missing from this playthrough were... A few of the gems. I mean, there's ten of each red, blue, and green jewel. But the ones we didn't get were either from the speedy spirits we missed, or from gold mice that appear only randomly. So, you know, it was kinda... If you watched, you would know how to get them. You just have to be lucky enough to run into the mice. And actually catch the speedy spirits. Neither of which I did. So. But, yeah. You know. Anyway. Again, if you liked this part, or this whole entire playthrough, subscribe to my videos up in the corner. Give me a good thumbs up. And be sure to check out the other parts of this, or my Spyro playthrough. Walkthrough, LP, whatever you want to call it. But anyway, now it's time. And so the matter of the ghost was settled. Professor Egad was so delighted to have all of his paintings returned that he used the treasure Luigi had found to build Luigi a new house. Are you ready for this? Luigi's Mansion. Congratulations, your mansion is complete. Rank A. See, they rank you depending on how much treasure you collect throughout the game. And this was the A rank mansion that I wanted. Yes! But anyway, as it says, that is the end. So. This is Obi-Wan362. Also, I didn't mention the comments in the section below if you want to. Anyway, that's our gold, and hope you all enjoyed it. I will see you all later.